with Ernesto Martinez of Solos, and I'm wearing a pair of really cool-looking glasses. What am I wearing here? So you're wearing the first product, uh, smart eyewear for uh, performance athletes, called also Solos. The idea behind this smart eyewear is uh, be able to give real-time feedback to the athlete via optical and display system mounted in front of the eyewear, as well as through a stereo system of speakers, which will provide audio feedback to the user as well. In this case, the cyclist, uh, as they're performing their uh, training, they will be able to hear and see real-time the data that they're generating. So right now, on, on this is really disconcerting because I can focus really well on it. It says I'm going 86 my, uh, RPM, uh, but it, and it's showing elevation change and uh, and uh, the power, the battery power on the device, and then uh, the it's power talking that to me. Oh, it's the power I'm generating. Oh, okay. Yeah. So all of the standard data that cyclists are training with power, speed, cadence, heart rate zones, elevation gain, etc., is something that you can actually visualize real time as you're doing it. Something that the standard bike computer today just displays in your handlebars, you're actually able to see it in a heads-up display, enabling the athlete to focus on the activity, that is, the ride, without continuously looking down at their display. So just like the high-end carts nowadays being able to display this in the windshield, the athlete will be able to replicate that experience as they're training or they're cycling and they're able to see all this. Uh, can you turn it off so that you can focus on riding for a while? You turn it on and off or is it always displaying? It, it, it turns off and on. You're able to customize how often does it come on and off okay. or if you want it to become automatically when you perform certain tasks. That is all customizable through the, uh, the app that we have developed. Oh, okay. that, that connects to, to the glasses. So in terms of architecture, the glasses connect to uh, the smartphone, which act as, as the hub of the complete system. All the sensors that are mounted on the bike or on your body communicate to the glasses through the phone and you're able to then customize what information gets displayed or uh, processed audibly uh, depending You on mentioned your... other sensors. Correct. What other sensors? Lactic acid sensor, oxygen sensors, and the plethora of upcoming sensor data that is going to be wearable in the oh, next okay. few years. Okay, not necessarily, you don't, that's not part of this product? No. Okay, great. So this is Solos, and what's the name of the company? Uh, Copen. How do you spell that? K-O-P-I-N. And the website is? Solos-wearables.com. Okay, great. And uh, how much are these going to cost? Uh, we're targeting a price of retail for $4.99, and we're uh, planning to launch commercially within the next six months. All right, great. Thank you very much. Thank you so much.